Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel of My Check Productions. I am Mike Check 95 Now before we get into tonight's subject matter, I would like to remind everyone that I do have Patreon accounts set up for this channel and my Simulation League RDW Red Dust Wrestling. Again, those links will be posted in the description box down below and on the video screen right here. Now normally I do movie reviews, I mean, as you've noticed, the last couple like weeks or whatever and everything, and I've been trying to get back into doing that. I have kind of fallen back to like not doing it every day the last couple days. I had to take a little break for a little bit just to kind of gather up my bearings again and try not to burn myself out on it. This video will not pertain to any specific movie or be a movie review at all. It mainly will pertain to my movie festival that I'll be holding in October this year the 7th Annual October Horror Fest. Now, as you guys know, who have followed my Check 95 in the past and have seen movies with me, I do hold a scary movie spooktacular festival every October for like horror movies and whatnot. Build up a schedule of movies, review them, and then at the end of the month or at the beginning of November, I compile it all in one list and see what film got the best rating out of all of them. Now this year, it'll be a little bit more different with everything that's been going on on the outside world and everything starting at the beginning of this year. Getting friends to come over to watch movies and review them will be a lot more difficult because of those said reasons. So I'll probably have to be doing a lot of those movie reviews on my own, which I honestly don't have a huge problem with. It just, it kind of sucks because I've used October Horror Fest as a way to bring friends together to watch movies and have a good time watch and review some movies and just have a flat out good time for the month of October just to get in the spirit of like Halloween and whatnot. And usually every year we try to like find new movies to watch every year that way we're not watching the same like six to seven movies every year. But this year will be also a little bit different. Um, besides with everything that's going on in the outside world, I also had to change jobs recently and financially I was not able to hold on to my streaming services, subscriptions, and I had to cancel a lot of them just to get myself balanced out back with like personal bills and whatnot. So until I get that whole situated, I won't be able to have any streaming services personally under my name. So that kind of cuts the uh, list of movies to watch over half, maybe like three fourths and whatnot. Um, my roommate says that he does have two streaming services that I could use. It just depends on what night that I do schedule uh, the movies and whatnot just so that we can use his account and he's here to like be present while I'm using it. But depending on how I schedule the movies, combining with my work schedule and his, we'll probably might be able to get a couple of movies from the streaming services we have. Besides that, I do have a very long uh, collection of horror movies, 80 movies to be more particular, that I do have as hard copies. I will probably be using those more this year than the streaming services. That way, like, I can just grab them and pop them in and, and watch it or whatnot. Um, I still do hope that I can get uh, some friends to come over to watch some films and review and whatnot. Fingers crossed, but I'm not holding my breath. I'm not giving my hopes up for it because, I mean, I'm not going to make everyone travel so far just to watch a movie and have to travel back the same night because I do live pretty far away from most of my friends. And of course, with what's going on in the outside world, it also kind of puts a, a wrench in this year's Horror Fest plans. But I am going to push forward. I am going to keep the festival going this year, and I'm going to try my hardest to get a full year done since I haven't been able to get a full year done since 2016 and 2017. Uh, the last two years uh, recently have, haven't really been the best. Um, Two years ago, it was a lot of like scheduling issues and just kind of like losing kind of like the will to like watch movies and everything. It was just really hard for me like mentally because I just moved to where I live at now. And last year, it was actually going pretty strong for a while and then I had a lot of like life changing issues that happened near the end of October. So I kind of just stopped reviewing movies that year. I had to like pretty much go through some like personal issues and kind of like, I guess, I guess you can kind of phrase it as trying to figure myself out again, which is also another reason why I kind of went silent on the Mike Check 95 channel and also why I've kind of been like on and off on this channel, Mike Check Productions. That's kind of why I went 
kind of silent near the end of last year uh, on my old mic check channel and it's also kind of why I've been like on and off on the mic check productions channel besides re-uploading some old videos the ones that I could salvage and save like I, like I said earlier I've been trying to get back into the movie reviews and trying to get back into making videos and at least uploading at least something either like a day apart or at least a couple days like apart from the last one I'm really not doing a good job on the uh, simulation league channel I'm almost like a month and a half behind I do apologize to all those RDW fans who do keep track of that channel and watch this channel as well. Again, I do strongly apologize for that. <laughs> That's just me not actually getting those videos done. Yeah. But um, besides the point, I will say that um, if you do have a movie request that you would like to push out to me that you want me to review in October Horror Fest, do let me know in the comments or do let me know on like social media through like to reach out to me on like Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and all that fun jazz. Pretty much this video is like short and sweet and everything. Um, I will be releasing a somewhat of a rough schedule of Horror Fest probably sometime next month and everything. Hopefully I can get it out earlier, a little before October. So it's not like super late like I did last year, but we're gonna have to wait and see how that goes. Hopefully I can get off my ass and actually do it. But Again, I just wanted to put that out there and let you know what's going on, and I hope you guys do understand the uh, situation that I'm dealing with and all the other situations that I've been dealing with over the last six, seven, eight, nine months, and hopefully you guys still enjoy my videos, and I will honestly be releasing a few more uh, movie reviews within the next few days. I do have a couple that I do want to watch. I still have to release my Friday the 13th part 3 review, which again, I do apologize for not pushing it out as soon as I said I was going to after my Man of Steel review. I just needed to take a little break, kind of like just relax, don't burn myself out on it because I'm, um, I don't want to like burn myself out on YouTube again and then take like a three month hiatus. After that will be the review of uh, Brightburn. I think I had that on my scheduled movie list as well. And then I have three to four four movie requests that have been issued out to me that I'm going to cover as well. I'll probably be balancing them in between movies that I want to review schedule-wise. But anyways, this has been a Mic Check production video. I hope you guys understand. I hope you guys enjoyed the info I dumped on you guys, and I will see you in the next video. Catch you later.